one of the ministerial nominees of President Tinubu's administration, Henry Dele Alake, has called for the regulation of the use of social media. Alake, one of the ministerial nominees, said the strengthening of laws regulating the use of social media in the country will go a long way at preventing abuse. Alake bared his mind when he appeared before the Senate screening at the National Assembly, Abuja. He stated that the social media has its positive side, which is the instant spread of news, while the negative side of fake news is detrimental to a good and decent society. The social media has two sides. There is a positive side, there is a negative side, just like every human endeavor. Now, the positive side, we all know, there is instant news. Whatever happens, you get it immediately, and then you can propagate your information widely at a very short time. And other things, you communicate faster with social media. However, the downside is so detrimental to good and decent society. What I will support is the strengthening of regulations. He lamented that the media laws in the country had become so weak that even victims were uninterested in using them. Continuing unequivocally, he said the war on frivolous use of the social media will be the first thing he will do as a minister, adding that he will strengthen the laws and applications of those laws while supporting anything that comes from the hallowed chamber on laws. Alaki was also quick to add that he has been on the editor chair for several years, and the most important point for an editor is to avoid litigation, emphasizing that the receiving public may not know this, and this ignorance may not allow the public to seize the opportunity to apply the full weight of the law when there is an infraction by any medium. I have been on the editor's chair for several years, and the most important point to an editor is to avoid litigation, but the receiving public may not know it. But the public will not also seize the opportunity of applying the full weight of the law when there is infraction by any medium, whether social media or the newspaper or online or electronic. So I will recommend a strengthening of our regulations and application of those regulations. It is not just to enact laws, but the laws must also be tested. It is from testing that we know the weight, the efficacy, proficiency, and efficiency of those regulations. So, from all indications, the much-needed sanity on social media operations which has eluded the industry will soon be seeing the light of day with Delia Alake's posture on the new media. Apart from being in the League of Veteran Journalists, Alake is also an activist and technocrat. He is a former commissioner for information and strategy in Lagos State between 1999 and 2007 under the then governor of Lagos State, Ashiwa Jubola Tinubu. He got involved in active politics in Nigeria as the communication advisor and confidant of Chief Moshur Kashima Wolawali Abiola, the winner of the annulled June 12 presidential election in Nigeria in 1993. In December 2014, Didi Alake resurfaced in national politics in Nigeria through its appointment as the Director of Media and Communication of the Buhari Campaign Organization to help Nigeria's former Head of State, General Muhammad Buhari, to victory in the presidential election in Nigeria in February 2015.